it's Ruth Rowland with the fiddle intro to Heartaches by the Numbers by Harlan Howard. If you're new here, subscribe and hit the notification bell for more classic fiddle solos. I'm going to show you this solo in uh, the intro in the key of B flat as on the Ray Price recording and a bunch of other recordings, but I've heard this in several different keys. I've heard it in G, I've heard it in A. So if your singer does it in a different key, you can use these same principles um, in any key. I'm going to show you how the intro was put together as I'm teaching it to you. So hang on. <laughs> this intro is the first line and the last line of the verse. So you'll recognize uh, heartache number one was when you loved me. And, um, and then the last line, you came back and never been to stay, right? So from the beginning, heartache number one, it starts on a downbeat, right? but we need to lead into it so everyone starts at the same time. So we're gonna do two chops to lead into it. And this, since this is in the key of B flat, I'm choosing B flat and uh, the note right across the string, uh, right across the fingerboard from it on the next string higher um, as my chops. Okay, now you may notice that uh, the chops are on the first finger, the downbeat is on the, the third finger, the first note, you know, of the, the actual tune. And we can put in this little passing tone on the way to make it uh, a little bit of a smoother on-ramp to the tune. But we're not done yet. If we put down the third finger a little bit late, that sounds really cool. <laughs> so let's let's try that together. Uh, I'll show you first. And with me, ready, play. Very good. Okay. So starting from that downbeat. All right. We'll just uh, play with the rhythm a little bit. And then instead of going straight to this C. We're going to dance around it. We're going to play the, the, instead of going straight to the second finger, we're going to play the first finger. We're going to play the third finger, right? So uh, instead of the two, we'll play the one, and then we'll do an upper neighbor to the next two. Okay. Good. And then we have a grace note for the last note as well, which is the third finger on the D string. So we get this. Does it make sense? So it's um, that part of the lead turns into Okay, so let's go from the two chops at the beginning. With me. Good, a little bit faster with me. Good, all right. Now we come to the doodly do which sounds fancy, um, and it, it is a little bit fancy, but um, I'm just gonna tap down with the third finger and roll off all my fingers uh, one by one. So um, you can drum your fingers on the fingerboard just like you're drumming them on a table, not just like it's the hands in a really strange position for that, okay? And then peel them off the fingerboard, just like the opposite of drumming them, and then 
play that F, make sure it's a real F, match this note, and, and we're going to tap down with the third finger and then peel all the other ones off. Okay. And in slow motion it sounds like this, but I encourage you to just, just do one fluid motion. Right? We don't care to have each precise note sound, it's just a gesture. Okay, so let's go back from um, dancing around the C. Okay, so it's an up bow with me and dancing around. Ready, go. Great. From the beginning. Price does a little pause before the next part. Um, Heartache number one was when you left me, when you left me, right? Um, just to suspense um, and maybe to take a breath. Instead of a pause, we're going to just go over to the third finger on the next string, string lower um, and play a little grace note. <laughs> And you notice, again, that I'm going from a first finger to a third finger. So let's go ahead and add that little passing tone. And we're not done yet. We can land late with the third finger again. With me. So back to the doodly-doo. Me. Excellent. Let's go back, take it back to dancing around the sea. We're from there, ready, go. All right, now from the very beginning, ready, go. not so tricky once you know what's going on, right? You can practice this. You, you see how you can practice this and get it up to speed? Yeah? Okay, so next part we have uh, You Came Back. Okay, so, um, and you can just play that if you want, but I'm teaching you the, the intro that Ray Price has on his recording, but that, you know, just just the melody is even cool. All right, so to turn it into the the one on the Ray Price recording, instead of right, he's gonna put a little F in there. Okay, um, and uh, let's put the the grace note on there. He has a C, an A two. play okay. and then let's lead into it walk up to it great let's put a couple of B flat grace notes on those walk up notes excellent with me Now, next comes a little doodly doo on the on the A string. This one is, starts down bow, and then the A is up bow. Ready, play. Good. And again, it's just putting your second finger down, right, and and uh, rolling off with all of your fingers to the open A string. But we're not actually going to the open A string because there's a grace note. Okay, 
Okay, so uh, since I'm, since I'm going to stay on the D string, I'm going to just play that A with the, my fourth finger. Okay, ready, play. Does that make sense? The grace note is the third finger, and the A is with the fourth finger. So one more time from the walk up. Yes. And then. <laughs> pretty straightforward. All those notes are actually in this intro. Um, he, he puts an upper neighbor. Okay. Uh, does the next grace note is an F. Okay. The next grace note is an F and a G. Okay, so it's just, just adding on. Okay. Ready, play. Excellent. Um, let's go from the doodly do. Very good. Now, next, he just plays a couple Ds just to take up space. And we're going to do some grace notes into those Ds. Just the lower neighbor. And put an F drone on it. That sounds really good, right? After that, leading into the singing, the vocal part, is just a B-flat arpeggio, but not only a B-flat arpeggio. Of course, he's going to decorate it with some upper neighbors, and then the last two notes of the, the chord, and then arpeggio is just a broken chord. It's a B-flat chord, all the notes. Um, but with the decorations. Okay, so with me. Good. And from the D's. Ready, play. Great. And let's go back to... Um, Ver meant to stay, right? Ready and play. All right, going back to the doodly do, the one on the A string starts down bow. second phrase from the beginning, from the walk up. Ready? Ready, play. great. Uh, and remember, don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell for more classic fiddle solos like this. We're going to play it straight through, slowly. Are you ready? Okay. With me.
看看。